so I thought I'd just do this quick little top tips video um, on how I match my alcohol marker colouring to either a pattern paper or an inky background that I've just made. And I've just finished this one in a video that I'm doing for my Crafty Potential channel um, and I want to add uh, this white frame and then I want to use uh, the Crafty Potential Safari Squad stamp set and um, add on some monkeys and some foliage to finish the rest of the card. So, how I go about choosing my colours is I have all my swatches and I've picked out here um, the swatches I think I'll need, so greens for the foliage and brownie colours for the monkeys. And all I, well, how I make my swatches, I make sure I colour right up to the edges because when you want to match a colour to your background, it's so much easier to just be able to hold it right up against the edge and see what colours you think will work. So, for this background, um, I thought to match the lightest uh, colour, which was the Vervain um, Aladdin dye ink, um, I'm thinking lime green would be brilliant because that's practically an exact match and a bit of the uh, bright green and these are my uh, pro marker swatches by the way um, yeah so lime green and bright green for my lightest colour then moving down I ink blended in some of the emerald eyes ink ink and so I think uh, the best colours to match with that look like lush green and pine I think so we've got a little bit of a an actual match and then a slightly darker colour to get some good shading and then for the brownie colour so trying to match this in with sort of monkey colours um, I think going down here an exact match is burgundy and this was actually the uh, walnut I've translated all of my colours of these because it's called brown and noix so that's walnut uh, yeah, so that was that ink. So burgundy is the exact match, and then I'm thinking walnut and um, terracotta as well, because the terracotta is sort of a nice orangey colour that would go with the uh, gold gilding polish that I've added to the background. So that's my how I uh, choose my colour choices when I'm trying to match my alcohol marker colouring to an inky background or a pattern paper background. Um, and so then... Here's the finished coloured ones to show how they all will coordinate perfectly because you've used colours that you specifically picked out. So I will add in a photo of the finished card at the end of this once I've finished it. I'm going to do that now. Um, yeah, so I thought it was just a nice quick little video just to show how I match my colours to my ink blender background and again for the ink blending of this background I used Vervain, Emerald and Walnut um, of the Aladdin Is Ink dye ink pads and I added on Gold Treasure yep, Gold Treasure Gilding Polish uh, through a stencil is the gold and then I've been matching it to my Pro marker colours and the pro marker colours I chose were burgundy, walnut, terracotta, uh, lime green, bright green, lush green, and pine. In case you want to know what these colours are, I'll hopefully write that below as well. So, thanks for watching, bye!